Welcome to Premath. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this given quadratic equation by completing the square method. And the very first thing we are going to do is to make sure that only x variables must be on the left hand side. That means this constant negative 50 must go on the other side. So we are going to have x squared plus x equals to when we move this negative 50 is going to become positive 50. So far so good. And the next thing just keep in your mind that our leading coefficient must be 1. In this case our leading coefficient is 1 so that means we are in good shape. And now in the next step we are going to focus on the coefficient of x the middle this number over here okay the coefficient of x is missing by default it is going to be 1 all right so I am going to put down write down 1 over here and then always remember we are going to divide whatever number we got over here divided by 2 and the final step is whatever this number we got we must square it and now whatever number we got this one we are going to add this one this fraction whatever this one on both sides of this equation let's go ahead and do that one so we're going to have x square plus x and then plus i'm going to put some space equal to 50 plus now i am going to add this quantity 1 over 2 square on this left hand side and 1 over 2 square on the right hand side as well and now let's look at the left hand side of this equation this part that i'm going to put a box this represents a perfect square so therefore we are going to use this fact a plus b square equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared so this could be written as x plus 1 over 2 square equals to on the right hand side is become 50 plus 1 over 2 square is going to be 1 over 4. And now let's go ahead and add these numbers on the right hand side. And I have copied down this one on this side. We can see the first number is a whole number and the second number is a fraction. Whenever we have a, this kind of combination, we can just simply merge them as a mixed number. 50 and 1 fourth. And now this become a mixed number. All right. So mixed number could be written as 4 times 50 is 200 plus 1 is going to make 201 over 4. So the right hand side I can write is 201 divided by 4 and this on the left hand side we still have a x plus 1 over 2 square. Now we want to get rid of this square. We want to remove this square. We're going to take the square root on both sides. Now we can see that this square and square root they undo each other. We ended up with x plus 1 over 2 equal to this is going to become positive or negative. This could be written as square root of 2 0 1. If we split it up this is going to become square root of 4 at the bottom. So that means this also could be written as x plus 1 over 2 equal to positive or negative square root of 2 over 1. The square root of 4 is going to be a simply 2. Let's move. We want to solve for x. So let's move this 1 over 2 on this right hand side so we can isolate x. And when this 1 over 2 goes on the right hand side, this is going to become negative 1 over 2 plus r minus square root of 201 divided by 2. 
And since we have the same common denominator 2, this could be written as, as x equals to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 2, 0, 1 and divided by 2. And now if we split these two signs, we are going to get simply our, we're going to have a two solutions. So first is going to be x equal to negative 1 plus square root of 201 divided by 2. And the other solution is going to be x equal to negative 1 minus square root of 201 divided by 2. And here is our solution set and that is our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.